Okay, so Fire is going to show us some of her moves, specifically loaded with oxygen. We put uh, oxygen in a few places that she feels she wants to experience it. Now, what you're getting right now, this is literally her very first trial moving with oxygen, other than standing with it. So we wanted to capture that first opinion a little bit more on the legs as she uh, requested because of where she feels she needs that. So we've got a bit of a neutral loading, a little bit of internal loading down low. And total load on her body right now is 246, 12, 14, 18. It's about two, close to four or five pounds. So it's quite a bit of weight, but uh, let's see what it is. We've got 100 on each arm piece. We're gonna let her go. And um, let me just make sure you're down there. Yeah, Farrah, do your stuff. All right. Different. It's it's weird. It's it's like it's I'm doing my skill. I have like my normal weight, but there I can feel my muscle like holding up me, yeah. holding like the weights up. Let me try something else. Yeah, yeah. Go yeah. ahead. Yeah. Now go All slowly. Right. Yeah. Take your time. <laughs> okay. Wow. How did that feel? It's interesting. Like I don't know because like maybe it's like only once, but I can feel the weight. They're not constricting me. Yep. They're not. It's not like you. It's like it's not like. Oh my God! There's something there. But you can feel it working. You can feel like the weight's working. Okay, that, that's cool. And because it's a first perception, and you're smiling, so it yeah. must be good. But what do you? Will you feel it working as in making you work, or? Um, I think it's making me. It's. I think what I like about it is because I am um, doing the. How is it like? I'm still like doing my exercise. I yep. still feel like it's normal, yep. but I yeah, there's something <laughs> there's, there's, there's something there, and I can't quite describe it. It's it's like I like it because I can still do my skills and I still can do it well. Cool. But I know that like my muscles are working an extra load, so I know when I take it off, it'll be much easier to do it, and that's what I really like about it. Yeah. Try, try a couple more. So yeah. this is that unique exogen experience yeah. where you're not just going to the gym and trying to become strong. You're training your sport, your sport for performance. Okay, so. I'm just going to try a leap here and see how that works. <laughs> that was really weird because I think I have weights on the back of my... Yes, we've loaded you specifically on the posterior chain. Yeah, so when I leap, I can actually feel like the weight on like my calf. Pulling it down. Yeah, pulling me down. So I'm... And then like this part's heavy. It's, it's really, really interesting. And then I like it because like I know that I, mean, I can do my routine with this. Yeah, and that's, not just gym training. Yeah, not just gym training. And like a few of the moves I've already done and... And then one, like, just even standing, I can already feel the weights. Yeah, yeah. I can already feel my muscles and, moving. And you know, you said, how much do you squat in the gym? You can do quarter squats and half squats with how much? About like uh, 100 kg, 120. 120 kg, so for you yeah. back in North America, that's 250 pounds. So these girls are strong. Yeah. But you've got just, you know, one or two kgs. Yeah. Does it feel like weight? It, there is weight. There feels like weight and then it's, it's really interesting because the first time, but I think what I want to do is I want to change the weights a bit and then see how it moves around the body. So I'm just going to, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these weights off. Okay, let's do it. Let's see. And this is yeah. the interesting thing I said at the beginning. When you get the chance to start experimenting, exploring, now here's a world-class athlete. And the first thing we're letting her do, find her own profile. Yeah. She knows her movement. She knows that feelings. We'll load her up according to what we know about the product. But literally, she's going to start finding this intuitive sense of where she needs loads. And it's as simple as stripping and moving around. And you can adjust like that depending where you are in your season, whether you've had an injury or tightness, where you're strong or weak. So what I'm doing now is I I have quite weak quadriceps, so yeah. I'm just I'm gonna just so a little. So this is back to where we kind of started. You yeah. wanted to change that, yeah. Yeah, because I want to just like leave out the load and see if I can carry myself. Now, just so you know what she's done here, mm. she's got everything anterior now, which yeah. the whole anterior chain and her lower limb is loaded, dispersed across three joints, which is nice. Yeah. And then I think the arms, I'm just gonna leave them with the arms. I think okay. I just wanna really experiment. Yeah, experiment, go ahead. Okay, this is really weird. It's like I can feel like the weights on the front, so I'm just like <laughs> It is. And the spin and the sprinters like that because yeah. it creates that initial acceleration. Yeah, so I'm just gonna do the same skill I did just now and see the difference. Okay. <laughs> That's awesome. It, 
like the like I can feel like really like the whole weight and then my muscles holding up the weight all in front. And this now was different because at the back, so it was kind of an equal distribution. Yep. So it's kind of just like holding weight, but with the weight change, I can actually feel like this part of the weight holding, and I need to hold it up and push my legs. And hard. and and what's really interesting is now remember. We didn't change the amount of load. Yeah. We didn't even change the location of the body, except she moved a few loads from the posterior side to the anterior side, and it became a completely different yeah. experience. And it's so interesting because this is like, for, for me, like it's just like 2.5 kg. Yep. And like that in the gym is, but on the body, it's nothing. It's nothing. On the body, is that like, because it's evenly distributed, I can feel everything. Yeah. And then I can already feel my muscles like trying to hold up the weight and I already can feel it working. Yeah. So that is really, really great. And I can't wait to try this on like on the actual events. Yeah. You know? <laughs> so, so last question. I yeah. mean, it's fantastic, you know, to see that smile on your face. And what's really interesting is one of the things we like too, and it kind of happened accidentally, is once we started yeah. loading the body, athletes just got excited about picking places that were relevant. Yeah. Do you think a product like this can help you in your training? Yeah, because for me, like, like for gymnasts, uh, we kind of like to, um, we use one side of the body more than the other. For example, like I am a rider, so my most of the, my right leg is slightly bigger. Yep. So I use that more to jump and stuff. Sure. And then for landing, I use more of like my other leg. So it's really interesting. So I can actually kind of make sure that both my legs are equally distributed, the muscles are equally distributed, and then so that the strength is equally distributed. And also because like you for gym, you can't have like like. 10 kg on and then expect to do like a double layout. You need to have it equally distributed light. and light. And I feel like really because of the way the motion is, I can actually move like no problem. I'll just try to sit here and see what that like would. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> so again, back to that point. Do you think, yeah. uh, I mean, you know, we're very conscious about creating a design that an athlete says I can move in. Yeah, yeah. We, we nailed that. You think yeah, it's you good? Yeah, I think it's great. And I love it because you can Take out the weights, put the weights, you can put how many weights you want, you yeah. can put, uh, you can do less weights, you can put whatever, wherever you want, I can put them on my body, I can do it back. And it's great because I can use it when I'm training, yeah. uh, when I actually do my weight training, yeah. and then actually have it on my body and do like circuit training, and that's really important, like doing circuit training and doing fast training, doing running. Yep. Doing and Your conditioning. Because, yeah, conditioning. Conditioning, yeah. I can do it on skills, specific yeah. skills, and then maybe like, for example, like I'm doing something and it's slow and I need right. to pick it up, so I put weights on where I need to pick it up, and then when I take it up, I'm like, oh, that's how it's supposed to be and strengthen that part. <laughs> Well, you said two things. First thing we're going to do, we're going to break away for a sec because what we're going to do now is strip these weights off yeah. and we're going to let her feel what it's like to go from nothing to a potentiation set where you're just free. Yeah. And then we're going to try her a quick uh, few minute circuit and we'll see how she says. Yeah. All right. Okay. Okay. That's awesome. It was cool, eh? Yeah. <laughs>